Good afternoon. I'm Mike Peterson with the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Monday afternoon. Big story out of Page County today. Zoning officials have upheld a ruling determining a material change was made to Invenergy's wind energy permit application. During a special meeting late last week, the county's Board of Adjustments upheld the decision made by Zoning Administrator J.D. King by a three to nothing vote after hearing testimony from Invenergy representatives and County Attorney Carl Songson. The ward was brought into discussion per Iowa Code to hear an appeal from Invenergy after they received a letter from King which stated there had been a material change in the Shenandoah Hills wind project, thus making the application, despite its August approval from the board's supervisors, null and void. Proposed school renovation and expansion projects hang in the balance in two KMA land school districts tomorrow, where special elections are set Tuesday in the Clarenda and Corning school districts on some major facilities referendums. Two questions are on the ballot in the Clarenda school district, a $14 million bond issue to make a number of improvements and renovations to the 712 and pre-K-6 buildings as well as a physical plant and equipment levy to projects not covered under the bond issue. There's also the special election in the Corning School District on proposed uh, bond issue, $19 million for renovations to Corning Elementary School and for a debt service levy between $2.70 and $4.05 per thousand dollars valuation to pay off the bond issue. Polls in both districts are open tomorrow from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. Speaking of special elections, plans for a proposed hotel in Mills County may depend on the results of a special election tomorrow. Voters in the county's unincorporated areas will decide the fate of a proposed 7% tax on hotel and motel rooms. Proceeds in the tax will be used to lower hotel development somewhere in the vicinity of Interstate 29 and Highway 34. Again, polls open from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. at three locations. More information available at the web story at kmaland.com. KMA on track weather, partly sunny this afternoon. Highs in the upper 40s, patchy fog overnight tonight. Otherwise, mostly cloudy, lows in the low 30s. More news at 5.05 and 6.05 this evening and online at kmaland.com. Have yourself a pleasant rest of your Monday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.